Hello friends, welcome back. So in this video, I'm going to install the Tailwind CSS here. And also I'm going to add the login here. Here we have the form. And also for register the same, just I'm going to add two more fields. So first let's open the tilewindcss.com, get started and choose the framework guides here. We use Vite and also we use Vue.js. So we have created the project. Now let's install the Tailwind CSS, the post CSS and the auto prefixer. So copy this, open the terminal and paste that in. Then we need to add the Tailwind CSS in it. So just copy this one, paste here. We need to add the index.html and all the files ends with the JS, view, TS and so on inside of the content in the Tailwind config.csjs. So let's open that file. I'm going to close what we have here and inside the Tailwind.config, inside the content, paste that in, save, close. Then in the styles, we need to add three lines for base components and utilities. So let's go inside the styles.style.css. I'm going to remove what we have by default and paste, paste here the Tailwind base components and utilities. Save, close, and then we are okay. We just need to run the npm run dev. So let's run npm run dev. Okay, let's open the project. And yeah, here we have the project with home, login and register. Now, nothing happened if we click, but we are going to change that. So here, yeah, let's go inside the components nav. And when we go to the login, we have the UL and here we have the LI. We are not going to use anchor tags. We are going to use the router link and say this is going to go to the slash or homepage. But I like the add names here. So let's say bind to and say here name and we need to add the name so home in this case and now let's open the router because inside here we don't add the router name so let's say also name and for this one i'm going to name it home and let's do the same thing for others so let's copy and paste it here and also paste it here and this is going to be name login and this is going to be name register let's save close this one now and yeah now we added the name home we need to close this router link like this the same thing for the login. So add the router link, which is going to point, point to the name uh, login. And also we need to close that. And the last one is for the register. So let's say router link bind to the name uh, name register very good save this one now and let's go back and refresh go to the login we we are in slash login as you can see here just now let's copy this uh, component here 
and let's open the login.view, save v setup, and inside the template, I'm going to paste this one. And if I save, go to the browser, we have the login page here now because we are in the login. We have the login form and let's zoom it out a little bit like this. And the same thing I want for the register. So let's go and in the register now, V setup, paste that in. Just here, we need the, let's say, sign in here and remove this one and also remove the forgot password. Let's save. Let's go. Yeah, we are in the register and also we don't need to say login, but let's say a register. We are going to work later, but for now, just yeah, here we have like a login, lo uh, register or go and login. And here we have login and forgot password or sign up. That's it about this video, friends. We have added the title in CSS and added the form for login and register. So see you in the next video. All the best.